Jules was born on February 8, 1828, as the oldest child of his family. He began thinking of ideas for a book at a young age of only 12 years old. Jules Verne went on many vacations with his wife that inspired him to write many books. He traveled around Europe and a couple of other countries. Jules Verne was a lawyer before he started to write books. His father convinced him to be in the business with him. Verne didn't exactly like the idea, but he wanted to impress his father, so he went along with it anyway. Jules Verne moved on to playwriting after quitting the job with his father. He would just sit and think of good play ideas. He didn't stay in the playwriting business for that long because he wasn't selling that well. One of Jules Verne's first vacations to get inspiration was in Barcelona, Spain. After writing novels from his vacation to Spain, he began to travel to other places around the world, such as Africa. One of Verne's most famous novels was called 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. That book was about how deep the sea can get at different points of the ocean. His first book was called Five Weeks in a Balloon. Five Weeks in a Balloon was about spending time in Africa and learning about Africa. One of Verne's most... A Floating City was a novel that Jules Verne had wrote a little earlier than most of his other novels. This book was a book that Jules Verne wrote about a city on top of a book. Journey to the Center of the Earth was a novel written about people traveling to the inside of the earth and thinking everything was fine to eat, touch, and nothing would happen to them. Extraordinary Voyages was a series of 54 novels. That was the most famous series Verne had ever written. It was the longest series that he had ever published. Most of the stories were about things that hadn't existed yet. This creative scientist had about 50 to 70 illustrations per book. His father wouldn't buy supplies for him, so he had to support himself. As creative as he was, Verne was known for his illustrations. Whenever he had free time, he would draw no matter what. Jules Verne's favorite hobby was to draw and create novels. Even if he thought his novel was complete, he kept drawing because he wanted extras just in case. Someone created something in honor of Jules called the Undersea Lodge. It was an underwater hotel. The Undersea Lodge was the first underwater hotel created. He wanted to create this because he wanted to be the first one to create something like that. One of the most interesting things about Jules Verne is that he wrote about things that didn't even exist yet. The most popular one today would probably be the submarine. Jules had a great imagination. He thought about 10 different things that didn't even exist. Two of the things that didn't exist were called a taser and some sort of film device. There was a very fictional film created about the journey to the center of the earth novels. The movie was written about 50 years after Verne died. The Jules Verne died on March 24, 1905. He died many, many years after his mother. Thanks for watching.